So this project was born uh, from the question of what happens next uh, in the IKEA kitchen range. And uh, IKEA is always kind of looking for what are the kind of emerging shifts in behaviours and how are people using kitchens. And I think to answer this question they really wanted to uh, open up the question to outside influences. Uh, and that's why they approached the uh, Lund University and Eindhoven University to really start to think about what the future of the kitchen could be in 10 years time. And IDEO uh, was brought along in on that process to help facilitate that journey. What you see here is the, the results of this 18 months collaboration between IKEA, IDEO and the two universities. Uh, and what you see around us here is that we came up with throughout the project and I think feature very strongly in this kitchen that we see here. It's, it's about allowing human agency in behaviour. I think when we think about the future, we imagine things being done for us in a kind of roboticised kind of way where we're, we're less autonomous and we're less human. And what we wanted to do was really make room for human decision making in the future. And a really good example of this is, a, is, a, is this sink here, which is, you know, essentially it's, it's a sink that has two options. It's a sink that allows you to kind of put your grey water back into the system and kind of recycle it and reuse it. And it's also got black water, which you can kind of tip away and that's water that really is dirty and needs to be processed. So one thing we recognised on the project is that the, the table is really the centre of the kitchen and the, the kitchen is the centre of the home. So it's, it's really important to kind of make sure that the table remain the focus of the kitchen. Uh, and because we'll be living in smaller spaces and we'll be having a more kind of compact kind of living arrangements, that the table needed to be more than just a dining table. So this table is a dining table, it's a preparation surface, it's a hob. And then I think that the, what we're trying to, what we've built a prototype of in, in this exhibition is this projection system, which kind of through smart light allows you to kind of have an interface surface on a, an on inert passive object. And if we take the tomato and add broccoli and think about, well, what tastes good with both broccoli and tomato? Now we have kind of a narrow down list of what actually goes well with these, these, these foods. And then when we move it even closer together, we get recipe suggestions. And so this is a way of being able to kind of waste less food by helping you to be a better cook and helping you become more engaged with your food um, in a simple way and in a way that's not too technologically burdensome.